Vice yes. President Biden mm -hmm. said in last week's debate that he does not support the Green New Deal. But if you look at the Biden-Harris campaign website, it describes the Green New Deal as a crucial framework. Right. What exactly Drink, like would be question. the stance of a Biden-Harris administration toward answer the Green this. New Deal? Exactly. Everyone shut up. I want to hear her answer this directly. Sure. So first of all, I will repeat, and the American people know, that Joe Biden will not ban fracking. That is a fact. He said he would. That is right. a fact. Answer the question on Green New Deal, sweetheart. I will repeat that Joe Biden has been very clear that he West thinks Indy about Answer growing the question. jobs, which is why he will not increase taxes for anyone who makes less than $400,000 a year. Joe Biden's economic plan, Moody's, which is a reputable Wall Street firm, has said <laughs> we'll create 7 million more jobs than Donald Trump's. And part of those jobs that will be created by Joe Biden are going to be about clean energy and renewable energy. Green New Deal. Because you see, Answer the question. Joe understands. You just lied about fracking. The There's a video. We can pull up that video. I'm sure. Is burning, saying he'll including my home state of California. Bring up. She asked Joe you about the Green New Deal specifically. They the never answer. States. Will you pack the torch? Let me tell you. Storm. Joe Biden has Joe great has hair. Seen and talked with the farmers <laughs> Green New Deal. Let me tell you. Joe Biden will not raise taxes on anyone making more than the president. And so Joe believes again in science. I'll tell you something, Susan. I served when I first got to the Senate on the committee that's responsible for the environment. Do you know this administration took the word science off the website and then took the phrase climate change off the website? This, we have seen a Green New with this Deal. We'll give you one more chance, in West Indian Trading <laughs> and Company. But they changed the website. We're going to yeah. deal with it, but we're also How about you change jobs. your website Donald where it says the Green the New <laughs> Deal <laughs> is what you and support? Would someone bring up the, the website of, framework. of the crazy old bat, crazy you know. pandering biatch? Would someone bring that up? They're Let's changing it right now. Someone's getting fired. Some poor tech guy's like, oh, God, I got to write the code. Four years on what is an existential threat to us as human beings. Joe is about saying we're going to invest that in renewable energy. It's going to be about the creation of millions of jobs. Three seconds, Green New Deal, yes, no, go. Net um, zero <laughs> emissions by 2050. Do the CV. Carbon neutral like, by okay. 2035. Joe Biden, Joe or, Joe Biden or Donald Trump? Joe Biden. This Mike has Pence, been a lot of talk Harris, the Green Trump New Trump Deal, yes, no, yes. Oh! It's been to go backward instead of forward. We will also re-enter the climate agreement with pride. Senator Harris just said that climate change is an existential threat. Vice President Pence, do you believe that climate change poses an existential threat? As I said, Susan, the climate is changing. We'll follow the science. But uh, once again, uh, Senator Harris uh, is denying the fact now, that see, they're going to raise taxes. This is something else everyone needs to know. Because I, I can speak a little bit. And by the way, have a watch along, folks, because we do have to commentate at least right. more than average. Otherwise, they might ban us. She asked a very specific question right there to Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris did not answer. She let her off the hook. Green New Deal, it's on your yep. website. Didn't Green answer it. Site. Then she asks, yeah. there you go, right on the website. Green, Green New Deal is a deal. crucial framework. framework. Also, they said they were going to ban fracking. Then she asks Vice President Mike Pence. She asks him a very she asks him a very broad question, but requires a specific answer. Climate change, she said, is an existential threat. Do you believe that that's the case? And he'll say, well, listen, we'll follow the science, which is an entirely appropriate answer. That's not an appropriate answer for if your website says Green New Deal, right? Do you believe that's an existential yeah. threat? Well, I think that'll be determined by the science because science, by the way, is not the science. Science is something that develops, that changes. A lockdown was appropriate at the beginning of this pandemic, knowing science now and the CDC revising their own survival rates to about 100% for people under the age of 50. That's what science is. Science develops, science progresses. Learned. Science is a catalyst for things moving forward. Yeah. But she says, what do you, do you think it's an existential threat? And then she'll call him on it for not answering specifically. Specific question, she doesn't answer at all. A broad question, he answers with an appropriate broad answer, and then he gets called to the mat. Yeah. Watch Good Morning Mug Club live every Monday through Thursday at 10.15 Eastern.